she and her friends, there were three, there were actually four people in the car, went up to Stillwater to another friend's apartment for an end of the year barbecue, beach volleyball, that kind of thing. And uh, on their way home, uh, it, w it was the weekend of the calf fry at Tumbleweeds. And on her way home, uh, Randall Jean Albright III was going the wrong way on Highway 51 and hit her head on. She called me at 12, uh, 41, told me they were on their way home. And uh, I said, you know, I could hear them laughing, you know, how kids are. And I, did you have fun? Yes. I said, okay, be careful, I love you. The crash happened at 12.58. And I got the phone call at 1.11. Her best friend's mother called me and said there had been an accident and we needed to get to Stillwater. And my husband was in Boy City, <laughs> out of town. So I got my boys and got up there, got my dad and my uh, mom, they went with us. Um, and we actually passed it on the way. I didn't get the knock on the door like a lot of parents get because Christy had asked somebody who stopped to call her mom. And uh, I, little did I know that she was probably still in the car when we passed it because once they saw that there was nothing they could do for her, uh, they got the other three out. She was crushed from the neck down and he was uh, two and a half hours after the crash, he was um, 0.18. And the highway patrol told me that he was probably 0.2 or more when it happened. She was the energy in this house. You always knew what kind of mood she was in when she walked in the door. <laughs> The boots, the keys, the, you know, <laughs> everything. And our house is too quiet. You know, my boys, I have two boys also, and they were 15 and 17 when it happened. Um, and it, it just, it changed the dynamics of our family. I, I didn't know how to do a family of four because we'd been a family of five. She was strong-willed, stubborn, they say like her mom, but I don't see it. <laughs> she was funny, um, very smart. She was loyal to a fault. Uh, if you, you didn't want to come up against her, you know. But yeah, she was my oldest. And, uh, and it's like my boys, you know, instead of my middle one being the middle, he now became the oldest. And it just, it just kind of changed the dynamics of, of everything.